The city of Los Angeles is known for many things from Hollywood productions to the agonizing traffic on the 405 highway. But there is a rather large part of LA, 51 miles to be exact, that has largely been forgotten over the years. Anna Logan has more on this story. This is the LA River. Most of it is confined between concrete walls that were constructed after the city experienced devastating floods in the 1930s. But now the city of Los Angeles has submitted a plan that would revitalize 42 miles of the river and its surroundings. The plan would tear up a significant amount of concrete in order to build parks, bike paths, and natural habitats. 11 miles of the riverbed, which would extend from the Autry Museum to downtown LA, would be reconstructed to support a flourishing ecosystem. Friends of the Los Angeles River and other environmental organizations have served as the driving force of the plan that would connect the community to the river and green space. This is a way to create these areas where there are even loops where families can ride their bikes through their communities and along the river and, you know, have access to a place for solace. I and mean, we all love to hear water and to be able to see birds and, and know that um, that's in our backyard. We don't have to drive somewhere to do it. Dr. Lorraine Ludquist says there are still important um, questions yeah, that need to water, be answered. Uh, who owns which water? Um, how much water does the river need in order to um, support the new ecosystems and restored ecosystems? What should we be doing with that water? We have biologists who can do things like count bird species and, and find out which species are, are um, coming to the river. The city of Los Angeles is currently awaiting approval on the $1.3 billion project. It hopes to split the final cost with the federal government. No matter what the cost ends up being, the initial 11-mile segment will take over a decade to complete. The revitalization of the river will take anywhere from 30 to 50 years to complete. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers will be overseeing this process, and they're still currently working on their final report for the river. In Los Angeles, I'm Anna Logan, Valley View News.